It celebrates classic cinema, taking inspiration from Casablanca. And... Mm. We like it. It's solid. There are a few things, but you need a first draft ASAP. Sir, I guarantee I will not let you down. That's what we like to hear. Oh, and just one thing. I'll be checking up on you, making sure you're all working well together. Playing nice, so to speak. Playing nice? We've hired three other writers to lend a hand on the script. What? Well, Charlie, this is the team. This is Michael. He's penned such classics as The Super Cop and Double Down. Uh, this is Sophia. She has a unique perspective on storytelling that I think will suit the project perfectly. And finally, Judd. Hey, man. Well, I guess I'll leave you to it. Okay, let's get this out of the way. We're all here for one thing, and that's my movie. I'm assuming you're all professionals and read the synopsis. I read the spark notes. That'll do, I guess. All right, let's do uh, scene 35. All right, so it goes like this. Our lead, Jack, dashing and wealthy, pushes the villa doors open. The butler takes his coat as he confidently makes his way through the room. Jack hears a noise from above, high angle shot down on his face. He's in awe. That's when we see her. Camera zoom, halo spotlight behind her head. She's beautiful. He greets her by taking her hand. Mademoiselle, he says in a slight French accent. Monsieur, she teases back. We zoom as they both lean and... Before we continue, I just thought I'd let you know I saw the story a little differently. Agreed. Yeah, same. I'm sorry, you've got a problem with this? Well, when I read the synopsis, I thought it could be better, you know, take it in a different direction. I think we can make this film more modern and marketable. By all means, uh, explain your idea, I guess. Agent Jack rides the elevator up to the target location. Wait, you're seriously turning my idea into a run-of-the-mill action movie? Hey, 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 I'll let you talk. Let's be fair. Agent Jack rides the elevator up to the target location. He flicks his butterfly comb. The doors open. We handheld as he makes his way across the room, hiding behind a pillar. Focus pulled a bad guy. He walks out and silently pistols the guard. The shell echoes. He makes his way to the door. Bam! Throws it open. And there she is, the Princess of Latava. My God, is she beautiful. Picking her up, he whispers, Mademoiselle. She responds, Monsieur. They lean in and... Let me guess. Doves fly out from behind them. John Woo style. Dude, what if we got Megan Fox? I heard she's unavailable. What about... We are not turning my idea into your run-of-the-mill, wet dream, action hero fantasy bullshit, right? Oh, and your golden age Hollywood Oscar bait's a hundred times better? Look, what matters is asses in seats, the tickets, the box office. Our stories should appeal to a wider group of people. But who wants to watch an action movie if there's no meaning behind it? What do you mean? It needs to be something more than just a typical action flick. Please, enlighten me. No, stop. Jack and Mary sit opposite one another at a dinner table. Food lay decaying in front of them. The pig begins to bleed. Jack looks up, so does Mary. A gut-wrenching scream echoes in the old house. Mademoiselle, he whispers. Monsieur, she desperately replies. The wolves howl in the night. The house reflects Jack and Mary's relationship. This story needs something like this, a deeper meaning, something to make it distinct. After all, art only shows forth for those who simply reach out with a ball of string. We are not making an art house film. Well, at the moment, we aren't making any movie. Yeah, because someone had to butt in with their idea, which also meant that it's open season for everyone else. Oh, well, if that's the case, right, why don't we make it a comedy? 
All right, they're fun and everyone loves them. It could go something like this. Jack sits with, say, his pot dealer. Just, just hitting the bong. I mean, like, really going for it. It's both so cooked. And his friend is eating tacos. N no, a burger. He's eating a burger. And they're just living the dream, you know. But then they hear a knock at the door. Oh shit, Jack forgot his French tutor was coming today. Jack rushes over to the door and unlatches it. The door swings open. They focus on legs, move upwards. Oh shit, it's Mary. She's smoking hot. You can hear the cat calls from a mile away. Leaning against the doorway, trying to stay upright, Jack coughs out. <coughs> Mademoiselle. With a slight giggle, she says, <laughs> Monsieur. The door swings closed as Mary walks in. Do they walk in on his friend fucking a pie? How'd you know? We are not making a comedy, yeah? Well, okay, maybe not a straight comedy. I might have got just a little bit carried away, but add in some comedic elements, you know? It makes the characters more, more interesting and likeable. Hey, that's not a bad idea. Everyone, stop! This is my story, my vision, and you all are ruining it. I don't understand why I have to work with you idiots, let alone listen to your stupid ideas! Idiots! At least we're not self-righteous assholes. We're trying to help you out, Charlie, and all you've done is throw our ideas down the drain! Helping. Oh, please, mate, Come we're on. going in circles. If it wasn't for you, buddy, I'll be finished writing the second act. Believe it or not, Charlie, this industry is about cooperation. Cooperating, yeah. We have to be professional. Professionals, yeah, we professionals. We throw our toys out the cot like a child. Like a child! It's not just about you, boy. I'm the child, mate. Yeah. Because wanting a fight scene every two seconds is so mature. You want a fight scene, mate? I'll give you a fucking fight scene! What the hell is going on here? Ask Charlie. Every idea we give him, he shoots down. They're trying to turn my movie into something it's not. They see it as a dumb spy thriller, pretentious art house nightmare, mixed in with a shit brain comedy. But it's not any of those things. I see it as a love letter to old Hollywood, an artwork that celebrates the writers of old under a single vision, my vision. Yeah, I like the idea. Thank you so much, Ryan. No, 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 no. The action thriller in combination with the art house film with a dash of comedy. I think it's interesting, I think it could work. What? That's a fantastic idea. I think you've done a good job. I think it will be perfect. You know, the action scenes will help the film appeal to a wider audience. I was hoping you liked the story to have a deeper meaning. It'll complement the plot nicely. And the comedic elements are gonna make the characters a lot more interesting and charismatic. Great. The action scenes are gonna provide tension Deeper meaning is going to make us stand out from the other films, and the comedic value will make it kind of marvelous tone. Well done, team. You've done a great job.